What's up, YouTube? Here's the latest addition to my RC lineup. HPR Bullet Flux. This is the MT Body uh, Monster Truck. I also ordered the Clear Stadium Truck ST Body, which hopefully should come tomorrow. Clear Body, I paint that. You know, I like to do my custom paint jobs. This isn't bad, just uh, a bit colorful for me. And everybody has this body, so this paint job, so I gotta do me. I might order another uh, MT body too, clear one, so I could paint that. I gotta at least have a black body. Anyway, first impressions, I love this thing. Not used to it, used to my uh, Sprint the Flux cars. I, mean, I have two of those, I'm used to them. So this was a step in a different direction, and I'm glad I made that step. This thing is all that. At the end, I'm going to put the videos I did of me running it today. <clears throat> I took my boys out. I bought my boys the, uh, what are they called? The Hillian Animus from Hobby Town, USA. I bought, bought them one of each of those. Matter of fact, right here. Got them in a little toolbox. You know how I do. I ain't do nothing fancy to their toolbox, just a regular toolbox. Charger, the batteries are there. I'm gonna get some extra batteries. This one of my boys right here. That's the stadium truck. The other one has the, uh, I don't know, a thinner body. But they 2.4 gigahertz, so we all was able to run at the same time. Anyway, back to this. <clears throat> so I like it, it's fast, it does willies. I have a two cell light pole in here. 25C two cell light pole, 500. I'm sorry, 5,000. And you see from this little spot right there, I need a woolly bar. Damage the body on a flip. Antenna a little, little scuffed up. I know you can see that or not. Yeah, right there. I'm filming on my iPhone 5, so it's easier to do this and upload it than mess with the camcorder. Take the body off. It's all factory. I haven't done anything to it yet. I'm not going to do much to it, but I'm definitely going to change out this pinion. This is the, it comes with a 10. I'm going to get the 8. The only options I seen was 8 and 12. So I'm not trying to max out top speed with this thing, but I do want some, um, some punch. So I'm going to get uh, the 8 tooth pinion for it it's about six bucks i'm cool with the engine so far ah the servo they gotta go it's the same servo in the sprinter flux that's f10w whatever it's the same crappy servo in the sprinter flux and with these tires that servo's not doing it justice <clears throat> it has a problem recentering if i turn it's like, it's not enough power. That servo's horrible. They could at least put the 50 on here. Or at least the 20. I think they got a 20 or a 5. I forgot. But they got, HPI has a couple of servos of their own. I don't know why they put this little crappy 10 on here. It's the same one the damn car has. And these tires are like, what? 10 times the size of the tires that's on a one tenth scale car? It's ridiculous. But anyway, the only thing I'm going to do is change out this servo and the pinion. And just play with this thing. The suspension come with aluminum axles already. I mean, there's no tire, no great tire selection for this, for these cars. It's this one and the one with the stadium truck. I ordered the rims and the tires for the stadium truck because, like I said, I bought the body already. As I was saying, there's not too many options for these tires out here for this bullet for some reason. It's 14 millimeter hub uh, I might have to upgrade to a 17 or put a 17 adapter on here to get some different tires but I'm looking around now for some more options I got the, uh, the other option tires that bullet has the ST version with the uh, the V treads on them I have those coming with the other rims with the little bullet holes or circles or whatever <clears throat> anyway that's about it it's a nice truck 
battery cases, like six pins holding that in, which is like an overkill, but can't complain. On and off switch. Sprint the flux doesn't have that. Why? I don't know. Fan already installed. I had to install my own fans with my Sprint the flux. Uh, it has a capacitor too. And you can see it in there. Right there. Right there in the center. That's a capacitor. Already installed. I had to put one on my uh, Sprint the flux as well. Anyway, that's about it. Now I'm going to run the videos. I mean, I did, you know, having fun with my boys out in the park. I did a speed test because my radar gun finally came. And I showed an example of the Willys that it does off the um, factory setup with the two-cell two LiPo battery inside there. I'm not going three-cell. I don't want all that. I don't need all that. Two-cell is good enough. I said I'm going to do the servo and I'm going to do the pinion. And just have fun with the thing. I need some smoother tires. These are, like I said, off-roaders. They say all-terrain, but... They're naughty, they're bumpy, they're off-road tires. The V treads, they're like tractor, like like tractor, like farm tractor tires. So I don't really see them being street. I don't see them being too good for the street neither. But anyway. I'm gonna run these videos. Then once I upgrade a couple of things, I run another video. Later. My head. Thank you. 